Hello everyone, welcome to Singapore Culinary Experiments. Today's vlog is about my visit to IKEA. It's a Swedish lifestyle store which is called IKEA in Swedish slang and IKEA by English speakers. But here in Singapore we have a different slang called Singlish. So it's neither IKEA nor IKEA, it is IKEA. Whatever it is, let's go have a look at IKEA. So now I'm outside Queenstown Marty to take a bus. It's just a kilometer walk from here but since it's raining and I'm with my daughter I don't want to get drenched. So finally I reached and my friend is waiting inside for me with her son Yusuf. So let's go find her. So there she is. We took a kids friendly shopping trolleys for our kids and now we are headed towards the lifestyle exhibit section which is in the second floor. In the lifestyle exhibit you can find the exact look and feel of a lively home. You can find bundles of ideas that are smart, affordable and easy to apply even for compact size homes. Though I have visited this place a lot of times before, each time I find different and unique ideas and it's really energizing to look at these colorful living rooms. This is a living room model and this is a studio style apartment model and this is the couch section lot of couches everywhere Here we found the living room cabinets, drawers, chairs and all. And here we found a wide range of dining furniture, tableware and chairs etc. Here you get to see a sample of a full new kitchen cabinet. It looked so real that they have even kept the storage boxes in the cabinet. So this is how the studio room looks. It's got a bedroom and a living room inside. This is the outdoor furniture section. So finally now we are at the children's IKEA. Here we found children cutleries and uh, children babes, baby babes. So here we got some children furniture like play cot, crib, diaper changing table and mattress, cot bumpers etc. This whole baby room comes around $1032.
and this toy kitchen set it comes around like the big one is around $159 and the small one is around $59 and these are the toy crockeries and you have to buy them separate and this is a play mat that comes with a wooden roadway and Yusuf wanted to stay there forever These are the play mobiles for the baby cot. So now we are at the kids wardrobe section. These are all made of sturdy plastic and uh, some steel baskets. And this is toy organizer cabinet. With these toy storage cabinets you can keep your kids room clutter free and it's easy to maintain. You can teach them how to easily declutter their toys. And this is IKEA small land specially designed for kids and it's a perfect play area for kids who are taller than 90 centimeters. You can leave your kid here while you shop for a maximum of one hour. It's totally free and they don't charge you. Our kids were less than 90 centimeters so we didn't leave them here. So this is make a note as you shop counter and it's got a lot of pencils, papers and even measuring scales for you to measure your you know furniture or whatever you want. You can also make a note of the shortlisted stuff in this paper. So now we are at the children bedroom ideas. Kids would really love these cozy beds and they look really strong, durable and safe. This is like a normal bunk bed but it's got a sleepover tent on the top.
and now we are children toy section so some toys were on steel like for five dollar ninety cent and these mini football were for one dollar So now we are at the work spacious section. If you are looking for ideas to design your office room, then you ought to check these out. Wow, this is interesting. You can sleep over at your office room. And the bed also comes with a pullover storage boxes. Guess what? Now we are headed to the bathroom section and that's why our kids are playing with the mugs. So these basins comes with storage spaces for your toiletries. So that's all for today's vlog and I'll be covering the remaining sections in my future videos. Don't forget to subscribe.